Find the load carrying unit every member. I'm going to start by drawing the free body diagram of the entire structure because in this particular free body diagram I only have three unknowns, so I'm going to be able to solve for them. If I start by taking the sum of the moments in, at A, I have CX times 4 feet equals 800 times 7.5 feet, so CX is 1500. AX is, of course, minus CX, so that's going to be minus 1500, and AY has to be equal to 800. Now I can take the joint at A. I have AC and AB and the two reaction forces 800 and 1500 so I know that AB has to be equal to 1500 pounds and AC has to be equal to 800 pounds now if I take the joint at B, I know that I've got my 800 pound external load and AB and BC, which has to act along the member, so I'm going to have a slope of 4 over 7.5. If I take the sum of the forces in the X direction, I have AB plus 7.5 over the, whatever that hypotenuse would be, 4 squared plus 7.5 squared. BC has to be equal to 0, so BC is minus AB times, you plug that into your calculator, you get 8.5 over 7.5. So BC is 1,700 pounds, and that's all three of them.